He's India's first ever chess grandmaster, a five-time world chess champion. He's been described by today's top players as a legend, ageless, wise, and a genius. We're talking about Vishy Anand. He is currently India's top rated chess player. And in this video, we will learn more about the early life of this living legend. Anand's form and consistency are incredible. He continues to play in the upper echelons of chess for the last three decades. His career has spanned even longer than many of today's best players who have lived. His journey started from his hometown of Chennai in India. Anand was introduced to chess at six years old by his mother, Sushila. Now Sushila was a decent chess player, but was never associated with a club. He inherited her love for the game, and with her encouragement, chess captured this boy's imagination. Anand was the youngest of three siblings. His father worked as a mechanical engineer in India's Southern Railways. A few years later, he would be posted to Manila in the Philippines, and his family would go with him. Anand would continue his chess development in Manila, the Philippines. He was a huge fan of the one hour show called Chess Today. Unfortunately for Anand, the TV show aired when he was at school, so the mother took it upon herself to watch the program and notate games for him. At the end of each episode, the show presenter would leave a chess position for the viewers to solve. Typically, it'd be an endgame puzzle, but then the viewers would actually send in their answers to the TV station for a prize. Anand would come home from school, do his homework, and then focus on his chess. He would go through the games on TV with his small chess board. Now his favorite pastime is to solve chess puzzles and he would do this with his mother. With each correct answer, the TV station would announce his name on the next episode and he would also get a free chess book. He was able to build a large library due to winning so frequently. However, Vishy would spend most of his childhood in India. What helped nurture Vishy was also his school environment. Now, back in the day, uh, there weren't many Indian schools which had a huge emphasis on sports. Many had a focus on academics. Sporting ambition rarely went beyond high school. Contrast that to today, where awareness has grown in certain areas like cricket. Vishy was fortunate to study at Don Bosco, which had top facilities for both academics and sports. Vishy was a product of this school and would participate in many of their tournaments. This meant that he had to miss some classes due to competition and traveling, but he did receive special support from his school. Chennai is situated in Tamil Nadu, which at that time was a hotbed for chess activity. There were many strong Indian chess players who would frequent these events. Anand got to watch and learn from their play. Anand would break onto India's chess scene in 1983. He would win Tamil Nadu's Junior Chess Championship, as well as place fifth in the National Sub-Junior Chess Championship. There were many talented youngsters in Chennai. The Madras Chess Association decided to take a group of talented youngsters and get them to play in the National Team Chess Championship in Bombay. They were named the Madras Colts. In this tournament, Anand scored three and a half out of four and a remarkable victory against India's first international master, Manuel Aaron. This earned him a prize for the best performance on board one, which earned him a place in the National B Chess Championship in 1983. After the team championship, Anand would go straight to the National B Tournament. This event would test whether players would be capable of playing in the premier event in India, the National A. Anand finished in fourth and easily qualified for the National A Championship. From here, he would win the 1983 Under-16 Chess Tournament with a score of 9 out of 9. At the senior level, he would win two major open tournaments with the presence of international masters. Anand also saw success at the international level during these years, but we'll cover that at another time. This is Expertina and you've been watching Chess Watch. If you liked the video, please give this video a thumbs up. Also, please hit me up on my socials on the links below.